boys and girls, welcome back, Red Mist in the house once again. How you doing? I hope everyone's doing great. I'm doing great. And we, my friends, are playing some more Magic Legion. Now, I am still experiencing some, in, experiencing some internet trouble, so this video is probably going to be a fair bit shorter. But we're going to go ahead, we're going to open up some card packs, we're going to do some uh, map gameplay, and we're going to hopefully get some good heroes in amongst all of this now i really appreciate everyone that went ham on the likes button in yesterday's video if you would all go and do it again today that would be absolutely amazing and i love everybody so let's go ahead jump straight in to some map gameplay hopefully we can finish off this map really quickly and be able to get into the next zone because as i said in was it yesterday's video the zone that I want to get into that comes after this one is actually going to have another tower inside it. So I'm going to be grinding the tower off a of camera. So hopefully before the end of the event. Now I think the event's got two or three days left on it. I can't quite remember. Um, but before the end of the event, it would be nice if I can uh, grind out to the top of that tower and get the um the two six star hero cards and also the eight four to six star hero cards because that would be absolutely amazing if we can get them and obviously open them up before the event finishes but you can see here that tanks are becoming a little bit more tanky so i am starting to slowly um kind of reach the maximum point of this team now i'm not anywhere near it yet or at least i don't think i am anyway um but you can see that like obviously people aren't sort of getting one-shotted anymore that these tanks are surviving sort of a couple of hits from arno and stuff so it's not quite as easy as it has been all the way through but then at the same time it's still pretty easy so as I say, hopefully we're going to be able to go ahead and we're going to be able to destroy this map and destroy the tower, which would be the main goal before the end of the event. So you can see here as well, guys, we are super, super close to the end of this uh, area, which means we're going to get a ton of extra diamonds as well. So I'm probably going to try to open up the 120 um, box so spin the the wheel of fortune, I guess you could call it, a um, hundred and sixty times. So that would be really really cool um, if I can do that. But I'm not too sure now. I do have like four thousand diamonds, so that's gonna be three hero pack openings. Um, maybe if I can get like another four hundred diamonds from this map area, that could be enough to open up a fourth one um but i'm not too sure I, I haven't done the maths so i don't know how many diamonds i would need to open up four of them but hopefully either way hopefully we do have enough to open up the three which i'm pretty sure we do which would mean that we will be able to open up the four because of the fact of at the moment the event has the buy three of the um times 10 draws get a fourth one for free so that would be pretty cool so either way we are going to be getting 40 heroes in this event. Now, on top of all of that, guys, I do have my um, pick 5-star and pick 6-star on this server as well. Um, so you would have seen me use them up in yesterday's video on the other server. I believe I was on server 96 in yesterday's video, whereas today I'm in server 99 because you can see that I've got my... Um, my king and my arno right there now i do have three arnos in the reserve so i can evolve arno um pretty much straight away so i'm going to be using my um pick six star heroes to get myself three more uh, kings in this video so that i can level up both of them but hopefully if we are lucky we are going to be able to go ahead and get a ton of of good heroes from opening up the hero packs maybe another arno maybe a couple of kings a um, couple of kings would be absolutely amazing but this is the tricky part the tricky part is the fact that our arno almost 
just got one shot as you can see there so this is a little bit of a problem but to avoid that happening again we're going to turn this guy into a pig and as you can see here we're already below the 40 percent to be able to kill him so there we go reaper scythe taking out that 40 percent but you can see that arno almost got one shot right there which is a little bit of a problem for when we're kind of fighting bosses and stuff but hopefully not too many people are going to be targeting the back line and taking on our arno so we should be okay but we're going to continue leveling up gear and we're getting a ton of diamonds like look at that a thousand diamonds right there which is absolutely insane so that's going to give us a ton of extra diamonds i didn't actually think it was diamonds at the end of that i thought it was a six star hero card but you can see here guys that we are going to do this right now we're going to go ahead we're going to open up these ones but first off we need to claim our free ones so maybe we'll get super lucky and get some good ones from our freebies um who knows what was it like a couple i think it was last week we got a freebie arno so that would be great no we didn't get lucky again so two to get a free draw so we're gonna get the, a free draw in two and then i don't think we're gonna have enough to get another three after but hey it's okay so nothing too spectacular in that one we are gonna get a ton of heroes here so this is gonna give us a huge amount of uh points I, i'm not getting anything good at all but, oh nice we just got a king that's perfect now blood commander that's not too bad so we don't have enough diamonds in order to open up another three but it's okay opening up five nice we just got war mage a witch that's pretty decent so one more box see what we can get maybe we'll get another king if we're lucky um but no nothing so nothing too spectacular really other than the king and the war mage that we got which is pretty good but we do have these over here so getting that one king means that we're going to be able to get ourselves um a level up on the king but i tell you what we're going to do guys we're going to go get ourselves another war mage right here because this is going to be the most beautiful thing going so let's get ourselves um i think we need two to evolve um so let's get two of these bad boys right here because that's going to give us enough to evolve him um i believe and then what we're also going to do is we're going to scroll down and we're going to get the six stars and we are going to go get ourselves two kings because by getting two kings this means that we're going to be able to evolve him as well and remember guys that most of these uh, five and six star hero picks that i'm getting are all from this event that we're getting right now so that's pretty damn cool so getting two kings right there means that we're going to be able to do that right there beautiful stuff now let's scroll down here and go to our hero evolve we've only got four thousand runes that's a bit of a bummer so let's go ahead and upgrade the arno upgrade the king as well and we've got enough to upgrade our war mage right there so we need a f one more to upgrade our witch should we do it guys uh, screw it let's do it let's upgrade the witch as well because we do need um to have a good team on this server right now so where is the witch so there's the witch right there let's get one more of her and evolve her as well why not because of the fact that we are doing an absolute crazy job on this account so let's make everything evo plus nine so you can see there everything's evo plus nine looking really strong on this server and then we are going to be able to open up these so currently 747 we don't want to be looking at the rules we want to be looking at this right here so let's go and click all of these 14 coins each that's not too bad that's basically going to give us like another spin right there which isn't too bad at all um and then i tell you what we're going to do once we've done this we're going to be spinning this wheel but obviously we are going to be claiming up all of these rewards first nice this is a large box isn't it okay a medium box so not quite a large box but still medium box is better than no box so let's continue to open up these and get all of these points and then we will spin the wheel and obviously we'll get a ton of three star 
uh, gem chest because that's all this Wheel of Fortune ever wants to give you is the gems. So, yeah, maybe it will be nice to me and give me something else like the gold or the um, card ability points, which would be amazing. Um, but I can guarantee that probably five out of every single one of these spins are going to be... Um, whoops, I did not mean to click on that. Um, I would genuinely say that five out of every one of these spins are going to be the three-star gem chest. Because, well, from experience tells me from all servers, all three servers that I've been doing this on, that those gem chests are ridiculously high dropped rate. Um, like, and I mean a ridiculously high drop rate. If you watched a few videos back, I think it was, um, like, I think I went and got, like, eight or nine of the, uh, picks were that, uh, chest. So, hopefully, we're not going to get too many more, uh, plays like that, because that's not cool. Um, but the good thing that we did get is because we did decide to go and use, well, we got the king from the pick, but we are also got... Uh, we did also, I should say, go and get the things. Like, watch this, guys. Watch this. It's going to... I guarantee it. It's going to... There's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. There's one more. Guaranteed. There's five. So, five out of the ten were those uh, boxes. And I guarantee, again, we're probably going to get five again. Watch this. Ready? There's one. Yo, oh, it's, it's not doing it, guys. Wow, there's two, three, okay, only three in that one, so we we got quite lucky in that one, but we're going to be able to spin this two more times, hopefully we're not going to get too many of these uh, level three gem chests, but we did get two so far, um, ideally I just want to get fragments, um, so yeah, again four, so we're actually getting a little bit luckier with these ones we're getting a lot of fragments which is really really good for me absolutely love the fragments but at the same time we don't need those oh whoa hello did oh my god guys choose any one six star mount that's what i'm talking about we got it baby in this video we got the six star mount which in the old video would have been the bone dragon of the abyss in this video it is gonna be any six star mount so let's go ahead and we'll open up this bad boy right now well let's open up these gems right first so we happen to get 16 out of four spins that's pretty crazy was it four spins or was it five spins i think it was four spins but let's go ahead and open up this bad boy right here now I am going to be going for the motorcycle, um, so let's go for the motorcycle right here, but as you can see as well guys, the picking any of the heroes here, the Bone Dragon of the Abyss is not available in this chest, so there is no way possible to upgrade the Bone Dragon of the Abyss, which is really, really bad. Um, but let's go ahead and get the motorcycle. So basically what I'm trying to say, and I'm so, so glad that I could have showed you this in this video, um, is if you have this guy right here, he is a useless six star mount. Do not waste your time leveling him up. If he's the only six star that you have, then yeah, level him up and then transfer all of his skills to something else once you get it but you can never ever ever evolve this guy unless it was in the event so all of these bonus evolved bonuses that you would get you're never gonna get them until they decide to put this guy in the game again because you can't get him any other way but that event that happened last time so i don't know tell me in the comments what you think about that guys but we did just go and buy another motorcycle so we are going to evolve this which is going to give us a bonus 15% uh, final damage which is absolutely amazing so 
let's go ahead and evolve that up getting that bonus damage beautiful right there and we are moving on up so that is great now did get in that that did give us 200 because if we look at the details for getting um the rules right here for getting a six star mount you actually get 200 points and we just claimed a six star right there so that's pretty cool um we do have a couple more of the uh pick five star uh, six star heroes and a five star right there so we're basically sitting on like another 200 points but we're not going to use them just yet because obviously i'm going to go and do a few other things and we'll probably use them in tomorrow's video or whatever um so let's go and open up or spin this final one and get ourselves another five of the uh three star gem chest there oh okay we're gonna get six this time so making a comeback on those gem chests that we don't need whatsoever but we are three spins or three times ten spins away from getting the next reward which would be absolutely amazing because we will get another two six star hero picks but leave a like and hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel all for getting that motorcycle in this video if you've enjoyed it then please make sure you hit that like and subscribe as well and i shall see you all in the next one peace on the street